Hello, it is Bernadette. I am going to retry something that I botched up yesterday. Uh, where did I put it? Oh, there it is. Okay, so yesterday I had done this, an experiment, and then I messed it up last night. So I'm starting all over again today. So, and I should have actually stirred this and made sure that it was all still okay, but I forgot. Because I didn't... Okay, I need a little bit more water on this. And so yesterday and today, uh, my redo is of a uh, neon and metallic mix combination. And... Uh, so I am going to get the, this is my uh, base, which is uh, Beauty Tone uh, house paint. And I have mixed in with it some, uh, uh, there's no glue in this or no uh, Mod Podge in this one. And there is just Beauty Tone and, oh, correction, there is a little bit. Um, because this is beauty tone and, um, my, and a thing of a little bit, I guess about a quarter of a cup of, uh, um, sky blue deco art. And so for right now, I'm going to get it poured onto... And what actually ended up happening last night is I went out and uh, I was out for, oh, I don't know, five hours, six hours. And I came back and and uh, uh, after having uh, let it sit and, and uh, to dry and, and everything, and I came back and I uh, flipped it up to take a look at it, see what it looks like upright and it was still wet and I mean wet wet as in it started to run um, and so I ended up totally completely wrecking my uh, painting which was really sad because I really really liked it it was beautiful I loved it so today I am going to do this with less paint and hopefully it, hopefully I can, it works. And I'm going to try and be as quick as I can because uh, I'm number one, I'm I have to head out here shortly because someone is giving away in our area. Um, they are giving away a whole bunch of uh, art stuff, like acrylic paints and and resin and. Uh, all like I'm, I'm not going to take it all but um, I'm hoping to be able to get have enough to be able to um, add to my collection for for silicone molds and and uh, stuff like that maybe maybe little containers and so that I can do pours and and uh, and stuff like that. Now, 
I got, I found this coolest find at Dollar Tree. Dollar Tree has these bead necklaces. They're for Canada Day or or for the United States, they could be for uh, um, uh, your uh, Independence Day, July 4th. But with it, on the end of it was all these little, well, each string had a little cup. So I'm like, oh, perfect. So I wanted the beads anyways, but I thought this is perfect because what I'll do is I'll use the little cups for my uh, my pores so uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to try and reenact I don't know if it's gonna work but I'm gonna try and reenact what I did yesterday uh, and anyways using neon paints and so as I as I do one I will uh, I'll tell you what it is. Okay, so this is, I'm gonna start off with a metallic. This is my metallic green. And I will, uh, I've gotta to go to Dollar Tree and get some more of those beads and so that I can get some more of those little cups. Cause these are the uh, uh, Dollarama, I, I love Dollarama too. Uh, these are the Dollarama uh, shot glasses. And so anyways, what I have in here is I have metallic green. And I'll, I'll put in the, uh, uh, below, I'll, I'll put in the, the description of what, um, what I've done or what these are and how I got them. So, so I saw this on a video. And so what I'm going to do is I'm going to, that's the metallic green for that one. And then I'm going to, I'm just going to kind of go back and forth between metallics and, and neons and this is my neon green okay and now I'm going to do a neon blue on top of my metallic green And I'm going to do a metallic blue on top of my neon green. So I'm just going to go back and forth between neon and metallic. Okay, and that was the metallic. What do I want? I'm going to put, I'm going to put neon or yeah, neon red on top of this. and metallic red all right and now I'm going to do a uh, metallic yellow oh, I think I should have this one's a little thick I did add water, but I guess I didn't add enough. Okay, and then neon yellow. And, okay, so that was, all right. And I have a neon pink. But I think what I'm going to, okay, I'm going to put a neon pink on top of the yellow. On top of the metallic yellow. And here's why. Because, well, and that's a little thick too. I, again, I did add water, but I guess not enough. Okay, so now what I'm going to do is I'm going to top these two with the metallic silver and 
we don't really need as much. And I'm going to top this one with the metallic gold. All right, now watching Fiona, what she does, and I hope yesterday I did this and I sent the, I sent the uh, little cupcake thing uh, flying. So I'm gonna try not to do that again. And then I'm gonna have to go over here so that I can reach silver try and reach the silver Keep all my stuff on the side of the table in the way okay and then I'm gonna grab this little cup actually no, I'm, not. I'm going to pick these up because these are just little They are not reusable. All right, now, before I actually do my tilt, I am going to torch all the bubbles because I had shaken it and stirred it and and everything so okay there we go now I'm gonna put my glasses on the top of my head all right all right so let's tilt and see what happens on the camera because when I tilt it that way I can't actually see what it's doing bring it back to the center and then we'll tilt it that way Yesterday with my uh, uh, doing all of this, I ended up, I had this beautiful uh, fairy butterfly kind of creature and it was, she was beautiful. But then, as I said last night, I thought it was dry because I generally, generally after about four or five hours of leaving it, it's dry enough that I can pick it up. But it was not So I ended up having it uh, doing this, like the pouring and, and totally and completely took away. The beautiful creature. I'm going to 
set it down and I'm going to torch and see what see what I see or see what I get. Um, thinking that there's still too much paint on here. Not as much paint as there was on yesterday's, but still too much. Still too much paint. Try torching again. Um, wipe off the edges just to make sure that. Still, I mean, there there are pearls that are showing up, but it looks like there's still too much paint. So I'm going to tilt a little bit more. You 
and I did use 12 colors. So that is a fair bit of paint. If I do this again, maybe I'll just use six paints instead of 12. I do like the way that these little swirls are and my butane is running out. Try tilting one more time because there still seems to be a lot of paint. There we go. It's starting to. This is when I stopped yesterday because I didn't see it. Uh, um, I didn't see the paint moving anymore, so I stopped, and uh, I should have just held off for a few more seconds. So I'm going to let this drip and then I'm going to pull it back again to this corner um, so I kind of like Yeah, I was so upset with myself last night when I moved it and uh, it started to, uh, the paint started to move and run and I wrecked the beautiful fairy female woman um, that was in the painting.
and no matter what I did to try and fix it, it just wasn't, it just got worse and worse. So I just ended up wiping it, scraping it all off. So that I could start again today. And no matter how hard you try to re redo something, you're you're never gonna get the same effect. Try and reach. That's end. All right, so I'm going to torch one more time and then, oh, well, if I can. Um, I may have to shut you off and, uh, to fill for the butane. Just the butane. I have to find it. <clears throat> I think. Oh, no, right here. Here it is, but I think I'm going to have to replace it because I think I'm pretty much out. I think I'm pretty much out of beauty. Well, there we go, a little bit. Well, look at those popping up and I didn't use any silicone oil at all in this one this is all just Mod Podge Mod Podge and paint and a little bit of water I'm going to leave it and see what I get when it's dry. Uh, and this time, I'm not going to touch it. Well, I'm going to move it right now a little bit. But other than that, I'm not touching it again. I have to go out and do a bunch of stuff. I'll leave it here until tonight. And then I will use a popsicle stick to, uh, to test the sides and see what happens. All right, so. Oops. Look this way so you can see it and I will uh, take you down 
show you my hand kind of okay so there we go that is a close-up and this is an 11 by 14 so we'll we'll see what it looks like when it is uh, fully dry so thank you for joining me love y'all and let's paint again another day